Welcome back to the What's New in UVM 1.2 series. Uh, today we're going to cover a couple changes related to the config DB. Uh, so first change is the ability con to convert from a string to, no to an enum. There is, has been a helper class added called EV UVM enum wrapper. And related to that, uh, UVM now allows the ability to set a, a string config, either in config DB or from the command line, which it will actually get converted to an enum and set an enum. So let me give you an example of this, these two capabilities. So over here I uh, create an enum, which is basically an instruction, and I have a component uh, that has that uh, instruction as a field. Here we go, uvm field enum. Uh, we have an agent that has an instance of the component, and then we basically have a uvm test. And here is uh, where the interesting new code is. So the first thing I wanted to demonstrate is basically simply converting a string to an enum. So in this uh, uvm enum wrapper method, there is a from name function that can be called. So in this case, we're going to um, assign an add to this um, instruction. And we're using a string here. And we're going to print out uh, the name after the assignment. And here we're using the config db uvm config string, and we're we're also assigning the instruction inside my component. So this instruction we're talking about is uh, is over here, and we're going to assign it uh, an enum with the value write, and you can see the write is specified as a string. So let's run this and uh, see what happens. Uh, so the first thing that should print out is um, this add instruction. That we converted. So yes, we uh, use the EVM UVM enum wrapper to create to convert add into an enum. And next, we assign a write to the instruction inside the component. And inside the run phase, we print out the name of that instruction. So here, we printed out a write. So everything looks good. So now let's do the next thing and actually override all of this from the command line using basically this uh, set config string. So let's add it to the command line and let's rerun it and uh, we should see that this instruction inside our component is now a no-op. And here we go, we see this. So just an example, let me go ahead and run this in uh, UVM 1.1D and I'm going to comment this out because that doesn't exist in 1.1D and basically you'll see that uh, you know this functionality is not there and you get your uh, usual behavior. Where, um, where things don't get assigned and uh, UVM doesn't tell you anything about it. All right, let's move on to the next uh, feature. Um, it is um, the global and UVM component methods set and get config ha have now been deprecated. So in this example, I'm using uh, set config string and set conf and get config string, but this applies to the other ones, um, set config in set config object. So in, in 1.1D you might have been been using uh, these get config and set config methods. Uh, so in this example it's uh, pretty similar to the previous one. We have a component with two strings. And here in this example I just get a config string and print it out just to see um, the get config string working. And uh, here I set config string inside the UVM component. And here string 1 is set to S1. And inside the module, um, I set config string uh, for string 2. So this is this is calling the global one, global method, and this is calling the, um, the method inside the UVM component. Uh, so if I run this, it'll actually still work uh, in 1.2. However, it has been deprecated, so you will get a warning um, over here saying these, these uh, this API has been deprecated. But you can see things are working. We print out uh, uh, string 1 and string 2 in the run phase. And then early on, when we did the, the get config, we printed out string 1, which uh, we got um, S1 was the correct value. So now let's go over the recommended method to use is actually to use UVM uh, config string. Um, so setting these directly in UVM. Uh, config db as opposed to using the set config and get config methods which you know, largely 
uh, duplicate the functionality anyway. So this is not really anything new. Um, these methods are present in 1.1. I um, mean, the, the thing that's new is that these set and get config has been have been deprecated. Uh, in, this, in this example, this is a global method, and UVM config string is actually just a type def of UVM config db string. And this is a, a, a method called from the UVM component. And then the get method uh, is over here, a pretty similar um, get method over here. So let's go ahead and run this. And the results should be the same. Uh, the only difference should be that uh, there's no deprecation warning. Okay, and things look good, S1 and S2.